So here we are. Twiffland. Twiff headquarters. Let's get in the shot. Boyakasha. All right. It's only a matter of time. Only a few weeks away. July 14th, Colonial Theater. All of you will be there screaming your asses off. Or booing. Whatever you want. I really don't care. July 14th is just about personal redemption for yours truly. On the biggest stage we've got, Real Mania. I was humiliated by a nobody. A nobody with some ability. His name is e -Rock. He could fly all over the ring. But he's a nobody. He hasn't done anything in TWF. He can do a backflip. Whoopity do. A clock that is broken is correct twice a day. The sun even shines on a dog's ass sometimes. Okay? I've got blemishes, blemishes, blemishes on my record over the years. After a decade and a half, stuff happens. But the true measure of success, the true measure of a man's worth, a man's self-righteousness, the true measure of greatness is how we rebound from adversity. And this individual right here rebounds better than LeBron James and Bosch and Dwayne Wade combined. So show up July 14th. Boo me, please. I beg you. Boo me. Tell me you don't like me. Tell me I'm full of myself because it's motivation. Motivation times 100 to the 100th power. It's motivation to prove you wrong on how good I am. I've seen this a million times. New guys show up in TWF and they want to use me as a stepping stone. New guys show up in TWF and they want to backflip their way into your hearts. That's fine. That is fine. But the cockroach of the roster, the guy that won't die, the guy that's got more brain cells than every other simpleton in that locker room is right here. So, e -Rock, I beg you, show up July 14th at the Colonial Theater, face me one-on-one, -on -one, lose to me, and then humbly get your ass out of here. And those of you sitting in the crowd... You might get slapped. No, but show up, please. I beg you. Show up. Boo me. Tell me you don't like me. I love it. I love every single second of it. I am out.